when I visited the locker room, which is one of the scenes, I got um, I got turned on. And I, yeah, I know, I'm shocked. I was shocked. I kept saying to myself, wait a minute, you're 90, what is wrong with you? And then I thought, wait, there's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I didn't have so much contact with the other athletes, but I had contact with Tom, and Tom's a very good actor. He's, uh, he listens very carefully. He, um, he's, just a, he's just a sweet presence. He's concerned about what's going on with me, uh, how we feel about the scene, and uh, most of all, he listens like a good actor does. I was nervous. I showed up on set and, you know, there's just so many accomplished actors and um, they bring so much. You know, every time they, you know, choose onto a role, they put their heart and soul into it. And I knew that and I kind of come in as an amateur and just admire what they've done over their long career. So truly amazing women and just really proud to be associated with all the hard work that they put into this. It just takes your breath away. It's so magical and like... You know, these are the ladies I grew up on, these are the ladies I looked up to, these are the ladies whose lives have, as, not just as artists, but as humani human beings, humanitarians, you know, have, have given me the space to be the kind of artist that I want to be. You know, I was looking at them going, oh, I want to be like that. And I leave this process going, yeah, I still want to be like that. This way! We're almost done! Right here, please, straight ahead. And both of you. Come this way, one time, hold on. Right, no, right, and then Alex. Alex, see you on the back row. 